Let's put them into right. This is gonna be a random sort of stupid video, but I don't care. It's just something that keeps going through my head since my friend passed and um one of my mentors passed recently, so it's got me thinking even more because I keep remember things he used to say to me and I've been not neglecting it, but at the same time I have been slightly neglecting it. Like we will have a hygiene kit and a bathroom kit. But this is something he always taught me. And I'm gonna try to see somehow if it passes on to anybody else. And that is do you know how long that kit will last you? Because and it's not in a good situation like now, it's in a worse situation. So like you've got I don't know. You've got a really bad stomach and you've got diarrhea. You know how long that's going to last you. That's the question I was always asked by him. And the truth is, I don't know on that one anymore. I used to know exactly every single thing in my rucksack on how long things will last and how long things won't last. But I've been, as I said, I've been neglecting it and I've not been doing anything like that. But I know there's 150 sheets. I thought it would there. And I know I carry three of them, so that's 450 sheets. But I know roughly maybe how long it take how long it would last for. But it's something where we all need to sit down and look at and we all need to sit down and think about. Because if you're carrying something like that in your rucksack, you want to know how long it's gonna last for because there is certain things then you would have to suit then you would have to go and adapt but you want to adapt knowing when you have to adapt because then you can use that extra time more longer if you adapt to stuff what you know you can use like you can use moss to go to to work yourself with and everything like that and females you can use that as your female problem female problem products as well and um so yeah it's just it's things like that. It's small things like how long is that gonna last? Same as your hygiene kit. Like this is my hygiene kit. Yes, it is small, but there is a lot in here. Like that soap there. That's all the soap I have in my hygiene kit right now. I have, as you all know, I carry soap all over the place. But that's the soap I have in my hygiene kit right now. And. I know that can last me a month, easily a month, and I know I have three, four of these, maybe in my pack, or maybe even more. But it's things like that, we got to work out how long that would last for, because you don't want to run out of that. You don't want to run out the door and knowing that you've got something that's going to last you a day, or two, or three. I'm sorry, I don't believe in 72 hour stuff. I'm sorry, I really don't. 72 hours to me is just crazy. Not a time. It's just not going to work. But, like, if that lasts you 72 hours, there's something serious wrong with you. But it's just small things like that. It's the same as toothpaste. How long is the toothpaste going to last you? It's, it's just not. A question most people ask themselves. Not a question most people will go along and go, oh, yeah, that's going to last me a week. Or, hmm, yeah, that's going to last me a month. They do it. We do it with food, but we don't do it with things, other things we need, an essential piece of the kit we actually need and we actually use every single day. So that's my question to you. Do you know how long some of your kit lasts? Not food, but hygiene products. Um, yeah, mainly hygiene products, really. So yeah, All right. I'm leaving it here, guys. Thank you very much. Thank, the, thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. And if you like the video, please put a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please join us here at Plum Offense, and we will see you soon. Thank you. Bye.